top story this new time. Several people now recovering after a three alarm fire in Fall River last night. Several people injured, including a couple of firefighters working to learn more about what happened in Fall River overnight. Brittany Schaefer joining us live right now with the very latest. Well, Patrick, six residents and three firefighters were injured because of this fire. One resident is still in the hospital this noontime in critical condition. Now, the fire started on the first floor here and spread up where restoration crews have been boarding up windows. After fast moving flames tear through a triple decker. Fall River Fire tells us when they were called, an elderly woman was trapped on the second floor. When we showed up, there were heavy flames coming from the uh, first floor. Uh, thankfully, everyone was out of the building at that time. Officials tell us two bystanders pulled the trapped resident out of the building. That woman is still in critical condition due to smoke inhalation. District Chief Sean Flannery says three firefighters suffered minor injuries. He tells us everyone has been released from the hospital apart from the critically injured resident. 12 news cameras captured crews going in and out of the charred building. The remnants of a shower could be seen through a third floor window. 29 trucks and 69 firefighters and EMS were on scene of the three alarm fire. Flannery tells us the fire started on the first floor, spreading to the second and third, and the way the flames traveled made their job difficult. We advanced lines uh, into the house to knock the fire down. The problem was that it got into the walls and um, we spent a considerable amount of time uh, chasing it uh, in the walls and uh, trying to knock the fire down. And right now officials are working to determine what caused this fire. They are also unsure if the building is a total loss. We will bring you those updates as soon as we learn them. For now live in Fall River, I'm Brittany Schaefer, 12 News.